in this problem, consider the triangle T is a subset of R2 with vertices 0, 0, 1, 0, and 0, 1, uh, not filled in. And we want to give a continuous function R from the unit interval 0 to 1 to T such that R of 0 is 1 half comma 0 and R of 1 is 1 half comma 1 half. So drawing this out, so this is x, this is y. This is 0, 0, 1, 0, and this is 0, 1. And this triangle right here is t. We want to find some function r that goes from, it starts here at 1 half comma 0, and it ends here at 1 half comma 1 half. So there are many ways you can do it. Well, there are two ways of doing it that aren't redundant by going around it several times. You can go this way, the long way around, or you can go here to here, which is the way I'm going to do because I think it's easier. So we want to go from 1 half comma 0 to 1 0, and then from 1 0 to 1 half comma 1 half. So recall from earlier sections how to parameterize a line segment in Rn. We need a point on the line and a vector parallel to the direction of our line. So first, we're going to find R t. So I want to first define what happens when t goes from 0 to 1 half. So it's going to be given by, oh, we start at 1 half, 0. And then we have to go to, well, we do the vector, which is going to be 1 comma 0 minus 1 half comma 0. So it's going to be 1 half comma 0. But we have to go twice as fast because we're making it up from 0 to two, uh, 1 half as opposed to 0 to 1. So we have a 2t there. And after that, so we're at this point right now at time 1 half, we want to go over here. So we take a point on the line, well, natural 1 is going to be 1 comma 0. And then we have to go to 1 half comma 1 half. So that's just going to be the vector parallel to that direction. It's going to be 1 half comma Sorry, minus one half comma one half, because we're given by one half comma one half minus one comma zero. But we have to be careful because we have to we're going at a different speed than normal. We're not going at a unit speed. So the actual way to remedy this, sorry, move this over a little bit. You do two, like here, going twice as fast, t minus one half. So to make sure, uh, let's Raise this diagram for a sec. To, just to be more explicit, here t goes from 0 to 1 half, and here t goes from, sorry, 1 half to 1. Just to make sure this is well defined, um, at t equals 1 half, plug it in right here, so this is 1, we get 1 comma 0. Plug it in here, t equals 1 half. Well, this vanishes on the right side, and we just get 1 comma 0. So the function is well defined. And since it consists, uh, sorry, consists of two straight line segments, it's continuous also. And that does it. This is our function. And we're done.